Closer to home, thousands gathering across northeast Wisconsin to watch Trump swearing in. At the Brown County Republican headquarters, more than 100 people packed inside, but some local Democrats didn't even watch today's ceremony. NBC 26's Marissa D. Candido is live in Alloway tonight with reaction from both sides. Stacey, while this room was packed with Trump supporters, the Brown County Democratic headquarters was quiet today. Two very different moods recognizing the inauguration of Donald Trump. Now, some Republicans here were actually moved to tears while watching the inauguration today. Many volunteered with Trump's campaign in Brown County, their votes helping him take Wisconsin in November. While Republicans cheered, Democrats were more somber. One told me he's scared about the future under President Trump. I think the decisions that are going to be made for America from now for the next four years are going to be very poor ones. I think Donald Trump has tapped on to the pulse of the voter and I think it's all about the people this time. Langan told me he chose not to watch the inauguration ceremony today. And we also talked to 8th Congressional District Representative Mike Gallagher over the phone, who was at Trump's inauguration this morning. And you'll hear from him tonight on NBC 26 Live at 10. Live in Alloway, keeping you connected, Marissa DeCandido, NBC 26.